Mathematical! Welcome back to another YouTube video, and uh, this is probably one of my worst customs that I've done, because this is Princess Bubblegum. Yes, she doesn't have hair. I mean, face. She doesn't have a face. Due to them not doing a female face on this pink coloured hair, which you can get from Joker's Candy Floss from the Lego Batman, no, from the Lego DC Minifigure Series 1. The hair is from the Party Rock Girl from the Lego Minifigure Series, um, Blossom... Blossom's Torso from Powerpuff Girls, and the legs are from the Lego Movie 2's minifigure series, one of the pop stars. Um, if you don't want to use this hair, you can use one of the pop stars' hair, I, if it works better. But I was, I made this because of the new Adventure Time series that's coming out, and her hair is more like this than her usual, like, flat down with the tiara. Um, she also has sleeveless shirts and some shorts on in the new series, and some boots, so that's why I did this. It's just the face that, like, really annoys me, that there's no face on it. Um, uh, but I still think it's one of the worst customs I've done. Um, but I still think, uh, it needed to be done to celebrate Adventure Time getting a new season. Uh, with Marceline, the Vampire Queen, Old Finn, and Jake. No, I don't know. I haven't seen it yet, I've just looked at teasers. Um, but yeah, Princess Bubblegum, uh, Finn's first love interest in Adventure Time. I didn't really care for her that much, I preferred Marceline, the Vampire Queen, and Lumpy Space Princess, because they were more funny to me. Um, and yeah, uh, Princess Bubblegum, pretty smart, the scientist, big brain, thousand IQ, created the candy people, but also started a zombie apocalypse. Not sure how to feel about that. Um, but yeah. Other than that, I hope you all enjoyed this YouTube video. I'll see you all in the next one. Have a nice day, and bye. Stay home and stay safe.